Hey guys, Sausage here, and welcome back to Minecraft TLC. Now, uh, just as a quick note, I did record a whole episode, which I think would be episode 28, because the last one should be 27, um, but it didn't record the footage at all, so I'm going to quickly go over it. Luckily, I didn't do too much at all. I have all this dirt because I was filling in this area here where the sheep thing was going to go. And the only other thing I really did was I set the digital miner here to mine, um... To, oh, well, it's not really showing you, but I've, to, it's pretty much mining all the iron I can find. Because I mentioned a, a big plan that I had. But yeah, the tower was finished. I'll give you a tour of that in a second. Um, also, off cam previously, I built th uh, four more of those, so the computer is now massive. And... Yeah, it's absolutely fantastic. Now, there's a lot of different things that I mentioned in the previous episode. In fact, most of it was just talking, so you didn't miss too much. So I can summarise everything and recap everything for you in one go, which is going to be better for you, because you'll actually be watching me doing more interesting things, hopefully. So, down there, please. Thank you. Goodbye. Uh... Take all of these. Uh, what I'm planning on doing uh, that I mentioned previously is I'm not going to bother with the giant sheep dome that I had in mind originally. Pretty much what I will be doing instead is going to use that area out there to build a zoo. And I'm going to try and house as many creatures as possible that are in Minecraft. So anything that's a, a a potential mob in Minecraft if I can keep it in a zoo I will do but that only that will only be vanilla mobs uh, purely because there are specific reasons for this there's a mod that I'm going to be using that allows me to take the DNA of certain mobs and inject myself with their DNA and I gain special traits with, from that so if I steal the DNA of a chicken and then inject myself with a uh, chicken DNA, that will stop me from taking fall damage completely. So they have their uses, uh, but I actually, need, besides needing food, so we'll steal the apples. I'm actually really needing to um, get some Endermen. Now, according to my mini map, there is an Enderman over there somewhere. So I assume that's underground. So if we can ever get down this gap, thank you. I can go take this enderman on. Because I need ender pearls so I can make golden lassoes. If I can make two golden lassoes, I can get two of each mob and then put them in a zoo. And this zoo will have them have their specific enclosures. Now on the minimap I'm supposed to be directly above an enderman and you can hear him. So where is he? Where is he? He's down here somewhere. There he is. I got him, but there was no ender pearl from him. Damn you to hell. It's dark as balls in here. Ah! Oh, it's just one of those. Go away! Running away, running away. I don't actually have anything to worry about with those. <sighs> Go back up. I think there is a way I can actually set my map options, but I can't remember what that is. Is it this button? Yeah, radar. Random mobs. I don't know what this is. Um, show new tools off. Show play on. Hostile mobs on, but I could have. Yeah, mobs to display. There you go. Now, if I do all of these except the Enderman, I can actually only search for Enderman. Which is fantastic. So it won't show me any other mobs but Enderman. And there you go. Done. Done and done. Now only Endermen will be displayed. I guess the darker they are, the deeper they are underground. Now I need to kill a bunch of these guys off to get Ender Pearls. If I can get three of them, sorry, four of them, I'll be happy. But I doubt I'm going to be able to really. So down we go. Oh. And in case you're wondering what happens if he drops into lava, not much. Wow. Okay. Enderman, where are you? I can hear zombies. 
Oh god, there could be lava any minute. You'll notice gaps, but that's that's because of the digital miner. Okay, I can hear the Enderman now, but can't see him. But I can hear fire and lots of it. I can see nothing but black. It's my it's my uh, brightness settings really low. Yes, they are. Wow. Bit better. Thank you. Where's this Enderman? And this fire somehow? Okay, I've got to keep going down, I guess. Yes, I do. Yeah, killed you! There's a pearl. Don't know where all this flame's coming from. Ugh, that's a weird sound. Enderman through here somewhere? Oh, minecart! The hell are you? Temple caller, bucket of force, and creosote. Cheers for that. I really needed all that. And here another one. Ah! You shot me. Ah! Stop it! Stop hitting me! Bastard. Bastard duck. I should have brought torches with me, really, but I don't really need to. I'm fine. I am now, apparently... Right near the Enderman, so no, my luck is up here somewhere. It is pitch black. Oh, hello. Where would he be then? I think I should come back with torches. That might be a wise idea. Just die and die. Oh! Hello. You're slightly shiny. There are torches, so why can't they light the place up? Whew! I can actually see now. So where's this Enderman? Is this way? Hang on. Off, normal, fast. Thank you. No, he's over here now, apparently. Ah! Enderman, why you gotta do this? Where are you? Aha! Should be over here. No? Going straight up. Still not seeing ya. Screw it. Go to the surface. Oh, I heard you. There you are, hello. Kill him! Oh crap. I hate it when they teleport in caves because you can't find them. Ah! Oh, one more. Come on. At least I can make one golden lasso now. Oh, I could die, I could die, I could die, I don't want to die. Oh, that noise they make. It's horrible. If you're thinking that I'm wasting materials, think again. Plenty of them. Let's go over here. There's one over here somewhere. Apparently. Where'd he go? Where are my Enderman friends? Ooh. You're around here somewhere. I know you are. Ugh. See? Ah, has he gone to the surface? You better not have. Oh! Is it dark up there? That might explain why he could be up here. Ah, there's one over here somewhere. <sighs> All this for ender pearls. I mean, seriously. Ender pearls really do take the mick! Which is why I can't wait to grow a crop. Yes, there he is! Hello, my friend! Got him! Did he drop a pearl? No, he didn't. God damn it, I don't know what the hell that does. Used? Does it show me what it's used for? No. I have no idea. Where even the hell? Oh, there's my base, so I'm not too far away from my base. But I can't see any Endermans. Ugh. Right! Let's go make a golden lasso. Oh, well, at least just put the Ender Pearls away. So yeah, the whole plan, like I said, is to make a zoo, so I'm going to try and start building some of that. 
Um, the first few enclosures I'm going to do are just like farm animals because they're the easiest ones. Go away. Uh, another thing, I will want to improve my computer system. Um, I've actually found a way that I can store absolutely everything I have here. Go in there. Oh, that doesn't go in there. Okay. Why won't you go in there? It's a bit odd. Do I need to charge it? Anyway, let's go stand on the charge pad. That's not charging it up. What do I do with it? Temple core does not have enough energy. Oh, it was just a... And I go and waste it. Possibly bad. Possibly bad. Uh, but yeah, I, there is a thing I can do to make this wireless. So if I put... See, at applied. Hang on. There we go. I need to look for something called wireless unit. Where are you? I'll know you when I see you. You're very, very space age. No. That's it. Chest. That, that's, there you go. Wireless access point. Now, if I find out how to make that, so I need all of this to make it. Uh, Fluix Pearl, yeah, it's not, it's not that difficult to make, so if I make a wireless access point, and then make a, um, where is it, where is it, it's on here somewhere, one of these, the wireless access terminal, I then link that, that up to the wireless access port, and I can actually open this, um, wherever, remotely, wherever I want, so I just set the access thing down next to it, and then have the remote control, so I could be over in one of those and not have to come back to open that machine. I can open the computer straight from my inventory by just having one of these on my hotbar. And in fact, I think I'll go and try and do that right now. I'm not sure if it needs any extra power, so what I need for this, iron glass, wireless receiver and an ME cable. So we'll just get the iron and the glass, which is going to need more iron and a stick. I need a stick, and then we're going to need fluix dust. Oh, uh, we need an ender pearl. Sod it. We're not doing that now because we need ender pearls for everything. Uh, so if I just put like pearl, we only have the one ender pearl, which is going to be a pain in the ass because I need to make another three to at least start making some uh, ender pearl seeds. So yeah, I need to start growing some essence now. Do I have a watering can? No, I don't want that. I need to make a watering can. So, let's do that. Watering can. I'm going to be growing crops. I want at least a watering can. Yes, recipe please. Right. We need this one. So we need stone, a bowl, and some bone meal. Okay, so, stone? Uh, I don't think I've got a bowl, but I'll find out. Let's see, bowl. Oh, wow, I do actually have a bowl. There we go. And then, uh, bone meal? Yes, there we go, got some bone meal. Right, we can make one of those right now. And, doop, there you go, watering can. Always, 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 if you're ever going to do anything remotely with farming on this pack, make a watering can. All you need to do is exactly the recipe I did. Stab here, right click. It is now full, though you won't know. But when you hold it down, there, go away. When you hold that, when you hold this down, if you've got your particle effects, you'll know it's full. And what this does is it just speeds up the growth of crops very quickly. So if I plant this as a fresh seed and now water it, it should grow a lot faster than it normally would. It's not very entertaining to watch. There you go, look. And I keep holding it on, keep holding it, keep holding it, and there you go instantly done. That's how quick you can get through it. So I highly recommend doing that. So what I'll probably do off cam is just literally water these to death and then just get a load of um, essence and there is a zombie just there. Hello. What the hell is that armor? I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, let's go get some more power. I'm not sure if I mentioned this at all, I might have done in some of the episodes, but I mentioned it again anyway. The reason I'm now using carrots for biofuel is apparently uh, grind, uh, putting the wheat into the crusher actually just makes uh, flour now. It's supposed to also make... 
It's supposed to also make the um, biofuel. I have checked the recipe, but it just makes flour. So, I don't know why, but I'll get onto that at some point and find out. Which is going to be great. I also have huge plans for this series. So, hopefully, if all goes well, there might, and you heard it here first, guys, might be story going on behind this. So, it's not just me playing Minecraft. There will be a story. So, yay for story-based awesomeness. And... Munch on my power. Okay, so what's that? That's weak essence and then essence dust. Okay. Uh, so you make essence dust into weak essence to make some stuff. I'm only really... I'm not really wanting to go completely into magical crops. Because let's face it. With this plowing away through all of the iron that I'm getting now. Yeah, all of that. And I double the whole lot. So whatever you see here is going to be doubled. And I've still got 1,069 of them to fetch. So that is going to be doubled, and considering I have, uh, I can make another machine, I can also triple it just by taking the oxygen from here and putting it into the machine, I can actually triple my ores. So tripling them is probably as far as I'm going to need to go because I don't think I'm going to need much more than that ever. But thank you all very much for watching. I'm going to leave it here for now. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back out here for a little bit, water all the crops, get a whole bunch of essence in this field, and make a couple of the seeds. What I will try and do, now I've got the recording working, and the, this footage is recording because I can see now, um, I will hit the record button as I'm doing it, like if I go to make a seed, and then I'll just put it at the beginning of the next video and just speed through it so you can see me actually doing it so you know everything's totally legit. Okay, so I will uh, thank you all very much for watching. I'll leave it here right now. And uh, I'll catch you all next time for some more Minecraft TLC. Take care and goodbye.